Yo, what's up guys? Today we're going to be going over how to grow your gaming TikTok account. I'm going to be giving you the top five tips I personally use that helped me grow my account in under a month. So basically, if I'm going to head over to my analytics real quick to show, if I go to last 60 days, so it's had my account for about two months, but I really blew up in the last month or so. If you can see, I've accumulated almost 10 million views, almost 300k profile visits, almost a million likes, almost 60,000 comments, and 19,000 shares. Now, if we go to my daily views, I average maybe around 100K views a day. You see here, almost 200K views, 82K, 68K, 90K, 156K, 483K, 500K, 2.4 mil, almost a mil, 200K, 80K, 35K, that's a bad day, 136, almost 400K, 400K, 1.1 mil. Yeah, as you can see, basically the last couple weeks or so, my views have been really consistent. If we wanna go to the, to see if my followers are bots or inactive, we can go to followers. And you can see here that my followers are active throughout the day about peaking at around 44k followers per day around 4 p.m peaks around 50k ish every day so so now do you guys see that i'm a successful tiktoker here are my five top tips that helped me succeed all right guys so we're gonna start with tip number one use between three to six hashtags i've seen a lot of like really clouded accounts they use mostly three hashtags but i found it to work using between four to six in my range have worked really well for me personally but anywhere to the three three to six range you can get away with going pretty good for example here my uh, 2.8 million view video if you click on this i use one two three Three, four, five, six hashtags, and always make sure the hashtags pertain to what the video is about. So, for example, uh, it's Fortnite, uh, Fortnite noob because it's trolling default, Fortnite OG because it's a rare skin, and Fortnite funny. It could be funny to some people, but basically, you just want to use hashtags to for like whatever your content surrounding. So, if it's like Rock League, hashtag Rock League. If it's COD, hashtag COD. Stuff like that. You want to use hashtags that are similar to what the content you're posting. Tip number two: you want to use only viral sounds. So basically, when you choose a sound on TikTok. Please when you're on the mobile app you're gonna click post and then when you post a video you're gonna go to sounds and then more and if you click tiktok viral usually if you click like the top four songs you, your post will do way better than it would just with an original sound because the tiktok algorithm is going to push out those viral sounds more because you're using a sound that a bunch of other people have already liked so they're gonna account that into the algorithm you can still use other like tiktok famous songs but if you want to for the best chance for your video to go viral you want to use the tiktok viral sounds only all right guys let's move on to tip number three you want to keep your videos between 15 to 30 seconds long the shorter the better this is because for example if a video is 15 seconds someone at that point say they go to like the video and they leave a comment by the time they're done leaving the comment the video will reloop and it'll give you two views and it looks like that person wants to watch the video more and they're more interested in it so basically the, the shorter your video is the more tiktok is going to promote it because it looks like more people want to see it and the watch time is going to be at it going to be better because the most important thing on tiktok it, right now is watch time and that's what the algorithm picks up not likes not comments watch time so if your watch time is high you're gonna get more views all right guys let's move on to tip number four we're gonna be posting between two to three times a day but really in a general good rule of thumb as many times as you can post in a reasonable time frame of good quality content is good so if you can post four videos throughout the day and do it and separate it between a few hours between each video you have the best chance of hitting the for you page on each video because every time you post on the for you page it shows it to a different audience so you have a, you have an equal chance every time of getting viral the fifth and last tip that I'm going to be sharing with you guys is to post good quality and full screen videos on TikTok. This is because the look on TikTok to capture someone in the first few seconds of them watching the video is so important so they don't scroll past your video. So make sure to take like a little hook and hook them in instantly with the video. Make sure your caption is good. It hooks them in. Make sure the first thing anything says that the first thing they see captures them and what makes them watch the rest of the video. All right, guys, if you're still watching, here's a little bonus tip for you guys that are still stuck with me this whole time. And the last one is is to go live honestly i didn't expect it at first but going live is super beneficial not only can you get free gifts from people who donate to you which ends up being a lot of money in the end but you can also gain a lot of viewers and new followers from your live streams and it could potentially help boost your recent videos so you guys make sure once you hit a thousand followers definitely start going live every day or a couple times a day to really boost your account all right guys if you guys think this helps you out and if this does help you out in the future, make sure to come back, let me know in the comments, and also drop a like on this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.